So guys, welcome back once more the merchandise unboxing. We got a single box today. It's merchandise. I'm not quite sure what's in it, as usual. Surprise. As you can see, I finished uh, collecting all the glass cabinets and filling it up with kits now. The next part will be putting in lights in the cabinets and it's gonna take some time and, and probably not gonna be right now because I wanna have a diffused LED bars that lights into the kits and not from above. So, and I don't want LED strips going down the sides as well. So, uh, not quite sure how we're gonna do it yet, but it's gonna be done at some point. Now, let's start unboxing. We got an Nendoroid Sang Quilling. Not quite sure about the lighting. We need more lights here as well. Um, everything has gotten quite dark since we filled up the warehouse with stuff. Uh, Pop-up parade, yeah, we know those. Can't see through them. This big one, take a look at this. Chitara Ken Kaneshia Tenki. This is a Mega Me device. Uh, quite a big box actually, with water slides and everything. That's a nice big kit. And we got this Deer Stalker R and R from Ion Sega, good smile company. Also, really looks great. Just in our spirit. From Motoroid. Now this looks like the Gundam Universe kits more or less. We have this. Oh nice. It's almost like I want one of these myself. Galactus. These uh big one from Funko Pop. It's a jumbo kits and actual the silver surfer as well. What do we have? We have this, I think, this basket kit. Yeah, Jason Williams. Drifter motorcycle. Now this one looks very cool, actually. I was thinking about maybe when I get a real setup for unboxing weekly, I should have one of these turntables. I should have one so that I can put the figures that can actually stand by themselves so while I speak it can rotate but it rotates so slow so it'll take some time the Black Series and Dengar from Star Wars and is this the last one? No, this is a box of things we bundled together we have a Batman Collect to build a horse. I suppose the tail is here. Um, this one must be a paint yourself model. And then we have the Joker. They were really a nice looking guy, was he? Evil bastard. We have another Batman figure, Selina Kyle. And lastly, Warhammer 40,000 Ultramarine Reverb with Bolt Carbine. We had a few of these. I think the reason is they're actually, the, the paintwork is okay and 
they're cheap and big. So, yeah, that was about it. We are finished unboxing this one. I'm not quite sure when we will get some new ones. I think it will be next week, maybe. Things are slowing down a bit now, but uh, take a look at this. For you who love merchandise, we also have these Gundam kits, which actually looks crazy cool. So uh, just take a quick peek here. Most of you probably already know, but these kits, takes from like four six hours to 10 15 with weathering like this one maybe 20 huge perfect grade like this one is maybe 40 depending on how much you work you put into it we have easier kits like the batman real grade kits non-grade kits this one is like couple of hours maybe so all kinds of crazy cool stuff and uh, I really love these cabinets for the kids and I'm looking forward to the showroom being finished so we can actually start inviting people over for open houses and uh, maybe take a peek down here you never know there's gonna be some uh, cartoons here from the Gundam universe and we made room for, now this is going away today, huge couch here. So yeah, warehouse is uh, starting to look like something. I will be back probably next week, guys. Have a blast, bye.